So if you guys have been keeping up with this series, you will know that recently I've been asked to work as security for Raven's team and in the last episode I was followed by an anonymous player who we don't yet know the identity of. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, let's get right into it. So right now I am joined with the man, the myth, the legend. Professor Salty, hey. hello. Yeah, hello. How are I'm you? All. I'm alright, yeah, how are you? I am doing great. Right, so, for some people that don't know, do you want to actually explain what happened and how this all started? Well, basically, I was approached by uh, a man called SSR. He basically hired me to be a spy for the pirates, if you've heard of them. Well, yeah, so... No, you've heard of them. Obviously, I've heard of them. Um... Obviously, as you guys know, the pirates are currently attacking pretty much everyone on the server. They've been going to people's bases, stealing things. I actually went to a base on stream and found out that that base had been stolen from. But these pirates are going around attacking everyone. And if you didn't watch last episode, I was actually hired for security for Raven. Well, actually, I don't know about that yet because he hasn't got back to me. I'm getting a bit, I'm, it's a bit fishy because I don't know what's going on there. He asked if we wanted to work as security for him and his casino against the pirates. Now, at this point... Salty had already gone undercover because this is what SS doesn't know. SSR is the leader of the pirates. Is he the leader or just a member? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's leader, yeah. Right, okay. And how many people are in the pirates? Uh, there's... The ones I know of is Rip the Shim, someone called Cosmic, and SSSR. So there's three. Cosmic Ares? I think that's the one, yeah. All right, okay. In interesting, interesting. Okay. So these guys are obviously the people terrorizing the whole map. And they asked Salty to become a spy for them in our team. But they don't know that we know he's a spy and he's just working undercover the whole time. If you triple cross me, I'm going to be a little bit annoyed. Not uh, going to no, lie. Don't, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I <laughs> but I, I trust you. I trust, I trust your uh, your word. But I have one question. That's all I need to know. I need, I got, I need one answer. Do right. you know where they live? Not yet, no. Oh, is there a chance you could try and find out? Could you... Is SS on? He's not on the server. Right. Next time he's on, next time he's around, see if you can get the location of his rough area. Because, obviously, even though I haven't yet been hired for security against Raven or anything, I kind of want to take them out myself. Because it's oh, getting yeah. a little bit annoying that they keep coming stealing our stuff. And I don't want to do it right away as soon as they tell you the location. Because then they're probably going to realise... It's gonna be a bit oh, sus, yeah. he's just asked for the location. Five minutes later, the whole base is blown up. You know, I'd give it like a day or two. Because obviously the map's only 4K by 4K in total. So the thing, it doesn't, or is it 2K? I don't know. Either way, it's a bit, it's not that big of a map. You can get around it relatively fast on a helicopter. So the chances of us just naturally finding the base anyway, are, it's pretty high. Especially with the amount of people that we have that actually play the server. So if you can try and get that information, that would be fantastic if you do just let me know meet up with me i'm always chilling around here somewhere but um yeah just please let me know because i desperately need to know where that is because i want to take them out really badly really, really yes badly. yes i'll try my best right okay good right um before we get caught even though he's not on you said there was a couple other men rip shrimp goes rip that is that one of them yeah i think that's the one yeah yeah if we get, even though we're in the base even if we get caught it's gonna I don't, I don't. I just don't want to. Uh, I just don't want to be seen. But yeah, let me know if uh, if anything else pops up. If you can even be told the next striking plan, because if they tell you, oh yeah, we're gonna hit Swords Base later tonight, let me know because I'll just be ready and I'll get. I'll kill them when they. I'm not. I'm not standing for them. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna stand. I'm standing for. My, I said this from day one of this season. I'm not taking anyone's crap this season. If people wanna give it, if people wanna try and give it me. Then I'm going to give it back. End of story. So, uh, yes. Thank you for becoming a spy. And uh, I will hope to hear back from you very, very soon. Hey, guys. I just want to quickly say thank you to X Gamer for sending me a huge box full of stuff. X Gamer drinks are drinks for gamers, ironically, that help you with your focus, reaction speed, reflexes, and stamina. My personal favorite flavor that they sent me is, was Hyper Beast. It's actually really nice. It's full of flavor. And I've been drinking it a lot. It is a really, really nice drink. And it's also been replacing all of the bad full of sugar drinks I've been drinking in the past. So a huge thank you to X Gamer from me. Also, if you head to their website in the description, you can use code SWORD10 and save 10% on your order, which in my opinion is an absolute win. Anyway, thanks X Gamer for sponsoring the channel. Let's get back on with today's video. So now that we know that he is not actually working against us and he's working for us, 
extremely warmed me because now I know that I actually can find out information properly about the pirates and then help take them down when they go to attack Raven. But I have actually received a present of some sort by the guy called Adir55556. And he said, you guys got raided from the pirates, so I wanted to help everyone that got raided of them. Enjoy your late Christmas gift. Now, I don't know whose team Adir is on. He could actually be part of the pirates for all I know, but he gave me a stack and a half of iron, some coal blocks, and some gunpowder. I've been doing a lot of grinding recently, hence why I've got so much loot in here. But yeah, I'm just ready and hoping that sooner rather than later something actually starts so I can start defending people. Now, I haven't actually heard anything back from Raven. Hopefully, there'll be something more about that in the next episode. But yeah, as of right now, there has been nothing from Raven. I've not heard anything back from him. My teammates were saying, rumor has it, like, he could be Ghost. Now, obviously, that was one of my first suspicions anyway, considering the player, obviously, from last episode, if you guys didn't actually watch. The player from last episode, we in yellow, was stalked by a player who followed us up the staircase that goes into the secret sewers inside of here. And he left a sign that was right here that said, Ghost knows all and then put a sign down to uh, to the bottom, which meant we were 100% followed by Ghost. And Ghost came from this direction, which if we go this way, goes straight to Raven's base. This is a direct path to Ra Raven's base, which is, it, it kind of incriminates him a little bit. Now, if I do see him on, I'm definitely gonna ask him some questions. And I kind of want to grill him and just put him on the spot because usually I go easy with people and I'll just be like, especially with like the bigger YouTubers, obviously, because I'm not, I'm not as confident around them as I am everybody else. I'll go, I'll, I'll just like sort of not ask them that many questions, but I'm just going to straight up grill him and be like, are you ghost? What is going on? Is one of your members ghost? Do you know anything about ghosts? Tell me literally anything. If he stutters, if he like flinches a bit or gives me like a, a paused reply, I'm kind of going to suspect things, obviously. And also the main fact that I've heard nothing back about the pirates and the security mission. I don't know what is going on. I don't I know if he was... One of my members actually thought that he was potentially trying to buy time so he can do something of his own. And now he's had time to do this and he's, he's been able to work up to doing what he needed to do in these days that he's purchased while we have wait, been we waiting off for his reply. So next time I see him online, I'm literally the only person on right now because I'm doing this really early. But next time I see him online, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go and grill him and ask him what the hell is going on. But yeah, the road is coming along very, very well currently. And another thing I was thinking was Yellow was the only other person that knew about our meeting at the base. I told my teammates to stay back and keep working on the road whilst I have a meeting with someone. And Yellow was the only other person that knew about that because he was coming to the meeting. So I can't fully rule out the fact that it could be Yellow's team behind Ghost because, not gonna lie, I told him about obviously meeting up. He could have had his team follow. Anything could have happened. So Yellow 100% is still a potential member of the Ghost Corporation. Or even if it's just a solo man. I have no clue at the moment. Now, I did actually see some recommendations from some people in the uh, in the comments of the previous episodes saying I should make a racetrack and charge people to use it just for fun and for content. And I think I might actually do it because I think it could be really, really funny. Like I did mention last episode and at the start of this video, I'm starting to do more member-only videos. So I'd probably put that in a member-only video just because it isn't really main video worthy, just because it isn't really serious content. It's more jokative. But I really, really am considering doing something like that. So let me know if you... Uh, if you want to see that and if you guys haven't become a member yet head over to my main page and press join right next to subscribe or there is a link in the description if you want to do that now that also reminds me one member has actually just logged onto the server now and it's Tomer. now if you guys don't know Tomer actually contacted me a while back saying that he potentially wanted to turn away from ryan and he left me some signs on a tree now he came to me in game and said yo sword i've updated the tree so apparently there is another message on the tree so I'm going to go and check that out. Raven has actually just logged on as well. So potentially next episode could be me with Raven, uh, me possibly asking him about the ghost situation. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember the location of where Tom had left the signs off by heart. So I should just be able to fly over this direction and I should see the wool anytime soon. So boom, here is the tree. There is one sign, it seems. Break the stone behind you. Okay. Whoa, right, he's uh, he's gone a bit a bit further on this one. Read from the top to the bottom, then to the side one. Okay, so I guess you already know who I am, and if not, Big Youth. But there is one a bit of an update on what is going on. The Wild West had been robbed by people who call themselves the Pirates. For security reasons, my team changed the door codes 
but it's no fun giving you the codes. To get the passcode, you will have to complete the quest. Quest slash mission, whatever. I will contact you soon for the first quest or riddle. Okay, well, I guess that kind of spices it up a little bit, but... Is he on Ryan's team or not? I don't know what's going on here. I'm not gonna lie, I think I'd rather him just tell me the code at this point. But I guess I'm gonna have to go and contact him right now and see. And see if I can grab the first riddle. So yeah, now I'm just gonna have to wait and see what comes from Toma. Because I have no clue what's going on. I have no clue what the riddle's gonna be. I have no clue why he won't just tell me the passcode. But I guess it makes content, so I'm happy. But that is gonna come to the end of today's video. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to go down there and smash the like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. And I will see all of you guys in the next video. Peace.